Welcome to the Journey of Love and Light. Scorpio, this is your April general reading. As a general reading, it may not resonate with everyone. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind. I've already meditated over the cards and shuffled the cards, but I'm going to give the cards a few more shuffles as we get started for Scorpio's April reading. Scorpio, I hope all is well in your world. Let's get started. Spirit, show me clearly the message I need to see as it relates to April for Scorpio. Help them on their journey of love and light. Spirit, show me clearly what messages does Scorpio need to see? What messages does Scorpio need to see? Spirit, show me clearly what messages Scorpio needs to see. Spirit, show me clearly. One more card for Scorpio. All right. Okay, we have the Two of Cups, we have the Five of Coins, we have the Ten of Cups, and we have the three of wands okay Scorpio coming into the month of April again this is a general reading I love reading so this could be about a decision as you come into the month of April it could be a decision related to finances because you're you may be feeling a little low in terms of your finances um, but um, as we're moving forward here I'm, I'm I'm getting a sense that this is going to you know be a, a good outcome so um, Know that whatever choice that you need to make coming into the month of April, that um, all uh, your financial needs that you've been struggling with, you know, those um, situations are really not going to seem as important because, you know, in April, you know, you're going to be focusing on, um, you know, your ten of cups on your family, on your complete, you know, emotional fulfillment and your happiness because, you know, you're going to begin to uh, recognize that your ships are coming in. The things that you have been um, hoping for and wishing for, you know, they're just on the horizon. Um, and, you know, it's it's as a result of, you know, you having this, you know, complete fulfillment, this, you know, sense of emotional well-being. So even though, like, maybe your money is a little short, um, you know, you have lots of love, um, and, you know, coming in in the month of April. So let's let's keep going. So Spirit, show me clearly the message I need to see as it relates to this Two of Cups for... Scorpio. The nine of wands uh, the knight of wands. I came out in reverse initially, so we're just gonna see that. Leave it in upright for now and let's see what happens. Spirit show me clearly. Spirit, give me a message I need to see. Well, oh my goodness. Jumbo there. Okay, that's the Knight of Cups. Spirit, show me clearly. So it could be uh, Cancer's Pisces, Scorpio, it could be Sagittarius, Leo, Aries um, in your life that's um, a part of this decision that you're making. Spirit, show me clearly. Another card. Four. Temperance, patience is going to be required. One more card for. There we go. Okay. Let's continue on with this. So, um, there could be someone in you know coming into your life in the month of April or are already in your life in the month of April that is a fire sign, a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Um, but they bring you, but that person, they, they actually bring you some sort of emotional fulfillment. They, um, they help you fill up your cup, uh, in some way. So again, when you're feeling like, you know, a little down about your money, this, this energy, this, um, um, a fiery, passionate, you know, energy is, um, allowing you to feel emotionally fulfilled again, you know, here is your, you know, complete emotional fulfillment, but, um, this, the ships coming in definitely has required some patience for you. Um, but uh, know that um, ba basically all the truths are going to be revealed with the King of Swords here. This could be, again, Aquarius, uh, Gemini, or Libra um, as it relates to this, you know, uh, ships coming in. Or it could be just that knowing that you, you will gain clarity and, you know, things will get clearer as it relates to your, um, you know, your destiny um, uh, in the month of April. So Spirit, show me clearly the messages you need to see for Scorpio. Um, yeah, absolutely. So, um, looks like, um, you're going to, 
you're going to have a victory. This, you know, the six of wands is the card of victory. So, um, whatever it is that you need to overcome in terms of your finances, um, use that um, uh, love and uh, support that you have from those around you, uh, along with patience uh, as you're uh, waiting for your ships to come in, because knowing that that, you know, full truth and clarity is going to occur, you're, you know, you're going to, um, you know, um, uh, you know, have that victory or success in the situation, um, um, and you're no longer going to need to defend your boundaries um, because you know this. This is the six to the seven of wands. It, you know you've already won. There's no reason to defend your to defend your boundaries. Um, I, I feel like you need one more card here. Um, so I don't know if there's you know as it relates to this choice and this in this financial situation that you've. Um, you know, maybe uh, have felt a little bit um, uh, needing to uh, set boundaries, to um, uh, watch who you're giving your cups to, so to speak, you know, and watch where you're spending your energy, your time, your effort. Um, but uh, ultimately, you know, victories is yours. You, you have managed to um, ward off any of the challenges that you've encountered um, in the month of April to achieve that victory um, as you move forward on your journey of love and light. So I hope this was useful to, to you, Scorpio. Um, if it was, please like, share, and subscribe. I wish you nothing but the best on your journey of love and life.